Rose Cottage Notions, where we talk about sewing courage and creativity and a little bit, well, a lot about history bounding and historical clothing. Normally, I would have a much longer video for you and I would be in my different lighting uh, in my little studio space. And so I'm just kind of sharing a short video today to bring you up to speed on what I have been up to. I've been working on a 1940s set of lingerie, a bra, and a pair of tap pants. Um, that's going a little bit slower than <laughs> I was wanting it to, and this is the reason I want to introduce you to Rosalind Russell, um, who is my new Damascus sewing machine. And uh, I've been spending a long time this last couple of weeks researching treadle sewing machines and choosing between several that were on offer here in our area. And I went and picked her up last night uh, near, in a nearby town. Um, she's a lovely girl and she is, had been very well maintained. Uh, I purchased it from a woman whose grandmother used it uh, to do her sewing. And so I'm just looking forward to this opportunity to give this beauty, you know, <laughs> a little bit more life. Um, and wanted to share with you, uh, you know, this is something that I've never worked on before. I have not done much in the way of maintenance repair on sewing machines. So she'll need quite a bit of work to get up and running, but she, she moves beautifully. Um, you know, there's, there's no grinding, no nothing. I need to get a new belt and um, need to get her just taken apart and cleaned up. But the, the decals are beautiful. There's no buckling or car, uh, crocodiling of the, or alligator skin of the paint. Um, didn't have any of the accessories that come with her, so I will have some fun searching on eBay and Etsy to find bobbins and needles and, and such like for her. But this is my new adventure, and this is something I wanted to share with you because this channel is all about doing things that scare us, doing things that's kind of outside of our comfort zone, and just really embracing who we are and expressing it through our clothing and our creative activities. You will be seeing more of Rosalind Russell here, and uh, yes, named after that actress because she's one of my favorites of all time. Um, His Girl Friday is one of those movies that I could watch over and 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 over again. In two weeks, I'll be putting out a video, um, like normal, <laughs> um, and that will be on the, the 1940s tap pants that I'm working on. I've wanted a pair of some, uh, some underwear that I could wear underneath skirts uh, in the summertime to be much more cooler. And I'm going to be sharing that here with you. I'm in the process of, of working on the pattern right now and making sure it fits me. So I wanted to thank you for sticking with me this long, <laughs> even if it's not in my normal setting and with my normal makeup and hair and everything. This is, this is what I look like every single day. <laughs> encourage you to share this channel with others you think might benefit from uh, seeing someone who looks a lot like themselves doing fun and scary and creative things. There's, there's a couple of ways you can uh, share the video, you know, share it with friends on Facebook, um, other social media. You can join my Facebook group. There's a link down below. Uh, you can purchase some of my t-shirts or coffee mugs. <laughs> so there's a lot of different ways that you can support this channel so that I can continue to grow it and bring you really good videos that serve you. So until I see you again, I bid you joy. Bye.